Sam Wiseman. I'm a student intern of the House Divided Project, and today I'll be showing you how to make a story map JS. This is a service from Night Lab by Northwestern University, which allows you to tell a story using images and video all on an interactive map. So to start off with, you'll go to storymap.nightlab.com and just click the green button on the home page, make a story map. So all you have to do is log in with your Google account. You'll just click here and then sign in. Once that loads up, you go down to the green button on the bottom, click New. Go ahead and click Create. Okay, so you'll start off with a blank map right here. Um, and what kind of looks like PowerPoint on the side, you know, you have like your title slide and then a slide deck down here. Um, you can change the map background by clicking Options in the top left uh, and going down to Map Type. You can sort of change how this looks with watercolor or satellite image change the language or the font that you have here. You can also change the uh, starting text. It'll start off by just saying start exploring, but you can sort of adjust that if you'd like. We'll keep it as it is for now. So like on PowerPoint, you go down and click uh, headline to add your text. And if you'd like to add an image here, you can go over to media uh, on the left and click upload an image. I suggest doing this instead of adding a URL um, just because you don't have control over the URL so if the user takes it down uh, you'll lose your media. So I suggest saving or downloading the image um, just clicking choose file and let's use an image of Dickinson College. Great so you'll know it's all set when it loads up as a JPEG and then just hit upload. So you won't see it instantly but you know it's uploaded when you see a link down here uh, in story map form. How about we add a background to this entire thing? So you can go down to background options. You can change the color if you'd like. I'll keep it as is for now. Um, and then go to choose file. And let's use this image of Moncure Conway. Uh, so we'll just hit upload. You'll see it pop up as a link. Go ahead and close that. Okay, so you won't see everything immediately. That's where you have to use the preview tab. So right next to edit, go into preview mode and you can see how that's coming out. Now go back over to the Edit tab. Um, you'll see that there was no map there to begin with. Uh, you have to add a slide and then type in a location. So let's go with the birthplace of Moncure Conway, Stafford, Virginia. And we can type in a quick heading here like before and go down to add a caption. You can also uh, insert a link here if you'd like um, and it'll open automatically in a new window. You can also adjust the marker options. So uh, let's pick another file. Um, here we saved one. Click Upload. See it turn into a link. Then hit Close. Um, like before, you can upload an image. And there we go. Make sure you credit that. And then let's go on to add another slide. So we're telling a story about Dickinson College. So let's describe that here. And we'll have to change the text. It carries over each time. Great. So again, we can get a new image if we'd like. Go to choose file like before. Open that up. We'll place the existing file. And there you go. So we'll go back to the preview panel just to show you what this looks like all put together. Um, start at the beginning. So we have an overview map here of the sort of general area this is taking place in. Um, when you click start exploring, goes to the first location and then you use the left or right arrows um, to pan around the map. Uh, you can go back to map overview mode to focus uh, broadly. Um, if you'd like you can zoom in while you're in preview mode uh, by double clicking or hold down shift and double click to zoom out a little bit. So let's see what we have here. Okay great. So when you're all done uh, you can just go up to share You'll have a link uh, that's ready to use. You can share it on social media directly, um, add a description or maybe a thumbnail image if you'd like. So how about we choose from the ones we already have, uh, pick out that Moncure Conway one, or you can choose a new one um, just like we did before. You also have an embed code so you can just copy and paste all of this directly into a blog. All right, so let's go ahead and see how this looks. I'm just copying um, the link we have here Okay, awesome, so we have a full screen version and I think this is starting to look pretty good. Okay, so I hope this helped you get the uh, basics of Story Map and that now you can go out there and create some really creative stuff.